Okay, welcome back to another quick tutorial and this time I'm going to be showing you how to create or fake the zoom burst effect inside of Photoshop. Now if you don't know what zoom burst is, uh, it's the kind of effect that you get if you set the exposure time on your camera to let's say one second and during that time you zoom in or out with your lens. Now this creates an interesting kind of effect which looks something like this. But let's say you didn't use the technique and you want to emulate it in Photoshop. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to duplicate the layer, name it whatever, and uh, make the top layer invisible for a while. Click on the bottom layer and go to Filter, Blur, and uh, Radial Blur. You can play with the amount, I'll just go with 15. Make sure the blur method is set to zoom and quality, I think, good is good enough. So click OK. You need to wait for a while and now we have this picture blurred out and I, you can see it looks sort of like the zoom burst effect or maybe as if you took the picture out of a moving car and let's go to the top layer and make it visible again now what you need to do is uh, create a mask for the layer and hit G because we're going to use the gradient tool. Click on the middle of the picture and drag. The more you drag, the less of the picture will be blurred. And I want the card not to be blurry. So let's say I'll stop here. And you can see that most of the car is not blurred, but the background is. And this is what I wanted to create, sort of a motion blur or a zoom burst effect and that's it so let me know what you think uh, and i'll catch you on the next one